what's up? What's up, boss? How we doing, Return man? of the Mac. Yeah, let's go. OG will full send MMA. Return of the Mac is in the building. Anthony Lionheart Smith going into a big fight against Magomed Ankalaev. He says he's gonna light the octagon on fire and see who makes it out. That, that's absolutely what we gotta do, man. Listen, like I said uh, at the press conference, he's been in a bunch of competitions and no fucking fights. And, and that's what I'm here for. That's what the UFC pays me for. I signed a big fucking cushy deal last night uh, to do exactly that. That's what they expect out of me. And that's the only way I know how to do it. So uh, I'm excited, man. He's super tough. I'm, I don't wanna disrespect him at all. He's good, man. He's never out of position. He likes to fight inside of a box. We're gonna get him outside his fucking box. It seems like people are forgetting about Anthony Smith. You know what I mean? There's the 205 pound division that's been on fire with Jan Blachowicz, Yuri. But Anthony Smith is a guy that's been around this whole time. You know what I mean? And there was always the talk of the John Jones curse that affected Dominic Reyes, Tiago Santos. They said, look, that curse might affect Anthony Smith. You're four and two since the John Jones fight. That curse doesn't exist with you. It doesn't exist at all, man. The only, and my, those two losses are 100% me. You know what I mean? Those are on me. Those guys won those fights fair and square that night, but I, I gave him the opportunity to do that. So that's on me. Um, yeah, I don't. I, I think some of it, I don't fight as often as I used to either. You know what I mean? Like I, I had a couple surgeries after my last fight, so I haven't fought since September. Um, and it, it's weird how like Uncle I was pretending like I'm, I was put in this position because there was no one else. Like I wonder if he knows that like this fight was moved a couple different times for a couple reasons and it was all me. So like this is my fucking show. And, and, and I think a lot of people have forgotten that. Um, but I'm here to remind him Saturday night. I got a lot of respect for him, and that, uh, with that comes a lot of respect for a win over him. I had read somewhere that you had said there's a reason that they haven't booked the rematch with Glover and Yuri, or they haven't booked it with Jan Blachowicz because they're keeping eyes on my fight. You go in there, you get a knockout win, are you going to get that title shot? 100%. There's no way you can turn that down. You know what I mean? There's no way that they can turn me away again because I know how, how the UFC feels about him. I know, I, I know how everyone in the know and the brass feel about his skills and his abilities. You go in there and you take that head and you, and you put it on your mantle, the, there's a lot of things that come along with that and I think a title shot is one of them. I'd also heard you say, you know what, Dominic Reyes is a guy I might fight down the road, but he's gotta get a win first. And I had interviewed Dominic Reyes about a month ago and I was like, yeah, do, you wanna, do you wanna talk shit to anybody? And he goes, Anthony Smith, I don't like that guy. Where does that come from? Yeah, you know, we've been in a couple like little Twitter banter's back and forth. Listen, I, I think, I think in my last interview, I even said like I, I have a lot of respect for his game. I don't really know him as a person except for kind of the shit he's talked to me on Twitter before. Um, but he's not the smartest dude in the world, so it's like it's really easy just to fire back at him really quick. So he'll never win a war of words with me, and I think that pisses him off. Um, and I just don't give a shit about Dominic Reyes. Like I think I will fight him eventually because I do think he'll get back on a winning streak. Man, that guy's good. So. Uh, he, he's a dangerous dude. I think once he gets his confidence and his swag back a little bit, I think he'll get rolling. So I suspect I will see him at some point in time. Um, but but I, you know, I just, he's just not my kind of guy. And maybe, it's, maybe he's not my kind of guy because he doesn't like me. Maybe that's part of it. I don't know. Fuck him. <laughs> hey, he's the Lionheart. He's got wait, a big... Wait, is, this where I, is this where I go? Oh, did, did I say that? My bad. My bad. I didn't mean to say that. <laughs> right, right, right. Oh, yeah. oh, hum, right? Yeah, Isn't that how it is? That's what he was saying. He's like, he's like, oh, maybe it's his aw oh, shucks attitude, right? Yeah. Oh, man, I didn't mean that. I'm sorry, man. I apologize. <laughs> I guess it's just his, like, aw oh, shucks attitude. Like, oh, shucks. Oh, no. Oh, look what I did. Anthony Smith got a big fight against Magomed Ankalaev. As always, hey, I'm the OG. Like, comment, subscribe, full send MMA. I appreciate you, my man. Yo, boys, real quick, I just want to tell you about the Full Send supplements. I personally take the sleep capsules when I'm on the road, when I need to sleep during a flight. You can go to supplements.co, use the promo code OG15, and get your supplements. Like I said, I use the sleep capsules when I'm on the road and I need a rest. Let's go, boys.